Right now it's 5.30, a battle against bugs. More pesky spotted lanternflies are being found across the tri-state area this summer. Good evening, I'm Christine Johnson. Welcome back, I'm Dick Brennan. The lanternfly population is exploding right now, so what do you do if you come across them? CBS 2's Nick Calloway has more on that and spoke with some residents in Jersey City who had a serious run-in with the bugs. It was like a scene from a scary movie. Tens of thousands of spotted lanternflies descended on an apartment building in downtown Jersey City this week. They really like swarmed our building. By Friday, a few hundred of the pesky creatures remained alive. Ryan Zucker's puppy, Willie, likes to eat them. He's probably doing good work for the community by killing them. Just two blocks from that massive infestation sits Van Vorst Park. Mark Wesson lives nearby and is president of the group that maintains the green space. He worries about what will happen to all the trees he's planted if the pests make their way here. So it's tough to take care of what we have here. To have them come in here, we'd have a hard time controlling it. Experts say the invasive bugs don't hurt humans or animals, but they can cause damage to crops and hardwood trees. They are spreading fast across New Jersey and the tri-state area. So what can you do if you see one of these where you live? Well, you can smash them. In fact, you're encouraged to, but that really doesn't work that well when there are thousands of them. I asked Ann Nielsen, a Rutgers professor who does research to help farmers manage pests like this one. So in my yard, uh, I'll go around and I'll knock a bunch of them into soapy water. I don't have thousands. Um, I have a couple hundred, so it's manageable. For a major infestation, she recommends calling a pest control company. Spotted lanternflies don't fly very far, but they spread by hitching a ride on our cars. So if you're planning a road trip... Check your car, you know, kill what you find, leave them there, and then go do it. So there's a few minutes of their time to... to try to minimize that hitchhiking ability. Back at Van Vorst Park, Mark Wesson has only spotted one lanternfly in the park, but he knows more are coming. Well, we'd hate to have him come in here. As we were filming, we noticed one at the entrance to the park, so we did our part. In Jersey City, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News.